These are the ABCs of salvation. I found these and the short prayer afterward on the Bull Swamp website. A. Admit what you've done wrong and ask for forgiveness. All have sinned and come short of earning God's praise. For what one earns from sin is death, but eternal life is what one receives as a free gift from God in union with the Messiah, Jesus, our Lord. If we acknowledge our sins, then since he is trustworthy and just, he will forgive them and purify us from all wrongdoing. B. Believe that Jesus died on the cross and rose again as payment for your sins. For God so loved the world that he gave his only and unique son so that everyone who trusts in him may have eternal life instead of being utterly destroyed. For among the first things I passed on to you was what I also received, namely this, the Messiah died for our sins in accordance with what the scripture says, and he was buried, and he was raised on the third day in accordance with what the scripture says. But God demonstrates his own love for us, and then the Messiah died on our behalf while we were still sinners. C. Confess that Jesus is Lord and call on him for salvation. Choose to allow God to be in charge of your life. Then Jesus told his disciples, If anyone wants to come after me, let him say no to himself, take up his cross, and keep following me. If you acknowledge publicly with your mouth that Jesus is Lord and trust in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be delivered. For with the heart one goes on trusting and thus continues toward righteousness. While with the mouth one keeps on making public acknowledgement and thus continues toward deliverance. Everyone who calls on the name of the Lord will be delivered. If you can believe and would like to be saved from your sins, pray a simple prayer like this. Dear Lord Jesus, I know that I'm a sinner, and I ask you for forgiveness. I believe you died for my sins and rose from the dead. I turn from my sins and invite you to come into my heart and life. I want to trust and follow you as my Lord and Savior. In your name I pray. Amen. Now go out and find yourself a Bible-believing church and get involved. Y'all have a good day, and God bless you.